Good morning and welcome to a Silverstone circuit which has welcomed thousands of spectators. We're underway with a good reaction time for Armstrong, which is why Vix is uh, covering him off. Daruvula up to second place, though, getting past his teammate and trying to go around the outside. Lungard there in the ART. He will go around the outside. Armstrong falling backwards under pressure from Paul Chini, but it's Vix in the lead into turn number three. Oh, that's so close. Can he hang on in there? Lungard trying to keep it in. And Daruvula says, absolutely no way. That will give Paul Chini the position. And he is up to third. Lungard risked it, but he's fallen back to fourth. That is not what Devlin Di Francesco needed. Had a puncher in Le Castellet contending for the points. His puncher today is going to remove any chance of scoring them. That's Kari. So a problem for one try, and now a problem for a second one. He was running in 10th position. Now we're going to see why. This was Sergeant trying to take the position away, damaging his front wing and sending Kari into a spin. He's lucky he didn't go back on the racing line there. Lungard trying to sweep across and get out of the way. Hold the inside line. Armstrong sweeps around. Lovely move. And super stuff to go up to third. But can he hang on to it or will Lungard come back? Lungard on the inside in the white and black car. The white and red car of Armstrong has the inside line and completes that move for third position. Oh, and it's uh, it's our new joiner for this race weekend. Federico Malvestiti. The uh, Formula 4 driver making the step up to Formula 3 for this weekend. Is he going to try the same again? He is going to try the same again. Vix will surely get the elbows out. Daruvula knew it. He's off the road. That will give an opportunity to Armstrong, who goes all the way there, around the outside of Luffield. Will there be room to get the power down? The two teammates side by side. Who gets the better traction? Daruvula and Armstrong. Nothing between them. Identical cars. Identical team. This the battle for second place. Daruvula didn't really risk it, but went wide at Brooklyn. And somehow, they're in the same order. Oh, this big shot. That is a big crash. That is a big accident. I think it's Raul Hyman who is in the barriers. And we're just going to see the aftermath of it. And uh, amazing. Oh, it wasn't that big a hit in the end. Looked worse when we cut to it. On the charge, Schwarzman at the top of your pitcher, trying to take the position away from Lungard. And we've said he's been lackluster. Well, he's delivered up to fifth position. He's always been in the top five this year. And that run looks set to continue. And for the second time in FIA Formula 3, Yuri Vips wins a superb victory. <laughs> oh my god, so happy guys. He is absolutely in the form of his life at the moment. Super win for Yuri Vips ahead of Jan Jaruvula. And then Marcus Armstrong going to the podium for the third time this year. Good morning and welcome to the earliest race start of the season. Sunday begins with FIA Formula 3 and we've arrived at the conclusion of round four. We look to the lights. We've got three of them. Four, five. It's time for the second race of the weekend at Silverstone for Formula 3. The lights go out and it's a good start for Lawson, but he feels the need to cover off Lungard. It's PK contending for second place. They'll go side by side into turn one and PK will have the outside line. That turns into the inside line and second place. They're going to sort it out in the break zone, Pulcini going wheel to wheel with Armstrong, three wide there, getting very, very tight. He's got the inside line on Schwarzman. It's going to be fourth place for Pulcini. He'll move up. Nicely done then. This could be some move from Pulcini. And you know what it is? That is special stuff from the Italian driver who has got himself up to third. Oh, and there's an off from Lungard. He's overshot. But it's Pulcini putting pressure on for second place. Pulcini, the man on the move, he really needs this the most. PK trying to hang in there with DRS, but it's Pulcini who moves up and takes second position. Oh, here we go. Pulcini taking the lead, and Lawson's defense does not last. The Italian, who has threatened for the last nine laps to make his way through the field, now has the race lead. Now Vips has got an opportunity round the outside of Beckman. Oh, he's going to overshoot. That's terribly, terribly oh, wrong. Into the gravel. The Trying to go past the Trident. I think he's going to be able to do so. So that's third place at the moment. Can he attack for second? Thinking about it. Up to third goes Schwarzman with a tidy pass. Here we go then with Lawson in the MP. Schwarzman with the DRS. Will he be brave enough to sweep around the outside? Yes, he will. That's a great move to take second place. Vips on Hughes! Oh, that's going to oh. be contact, and it is! Vips is going to just storm up the inside here. 
and it's just wheels into locking. I wouldn't necessarily say there's anything malicious there at all. And now Sonoda trying to come right round the outside of both of them. That is an absolute stormer from Yuki Tsunoda. So oh, PK's cleared it. Oh, that's PK unfortunately. goes, PK spins, and it's damage to the front wing of one of the Primers. It's that the Rubler. always the risk. The Rubler has got too much damage to the front wing. He retires at the first corner. Look, that wing is actually spitting underneath the rear uh, front tire, and that's all game over for PK and the Rubler. What a shame. Leo Pulcini crosses the line to win at Silverstone, his first win of the year, and he leads home Schwartzman. Can Lawson hang on? He hangs on brilliantly. What a superb defensive drive from the youngest driver in the field to take his first podium in Formula 3. Yes, come on! Well done to Leonardo Pulcini on the car and celebrating his season up and running. Leo Pulcini with a super drive Robert Schwartzman moving up nicely to uh, take back the championship lead. Liam Lawson on the podium for the first time.